Eucharist among them was extremely strange. Okay, so, you know, the Christians came together as a group. Okay, they'll meet in a house or something. It was a secret gathering. And then they would uh, masturbate. Okay, and then sh- share the semen among e- each and every one of them, calling it the body of Christ. Okay, so Eucharist is all about the body of Christ, which, which is a cracker, and then the blood of Christ, which is wine. Okay, so then they distributed the semen uh, from men to everyone as the body of Christ. And then there was also blood of Christ. Okay, if some woman was menstruating, then her blood was collected and distributed to all the other Christians as the blood of Christ. Okay, so now this may sound very strange or even revolting to most of us but this is some of the earliest christian beliefs so whenever christians talk about eucharist blood of christ body of christ and all that symbolism and tell them hey this is what bot airman has revealed that in the earliest time uh, your body of christ was not a cheap cookie and your blood of christ was not some cheap wine it was actually the semen and the menstrual blood that were distributed among the earliest christians anyway now to your question on why the blacks have not abandoned christianity even though christianity is the direct reason for their enslavement oh that is beautiful just beautiful thank you so much